and action. Greetings, gorgeous humans. This is a Warrior One series. Warrior One, I'm gonna start with your feet about hip width apart, feet parallel on two different tracks. I'm gonna slide one foot back, in this case I'm sliding my left foot back and turning my left foot about, I don't know, about, if this is 90 degrees, this is 45 degrees, then this is about 20 something degrees off the center. Bend my front knee, so I've got the front knee bent and the knee is tracking over the ankle. If you could step back a little bit more and you're still able to plant that heel, hip points are forward and you could use this and that's warrior one here. You have your arms out, it's a lot easier to keep your balance here, but if you can lift your arms up without shrugging, just lower those shoulders. Most of you will find that you'll have your arms forward so you can get your arms above your head. So here, your arms are by your ears. That's warrior one. And then we are transitioning by extending front knee. So now both knees are extended and going to a standing half pyramid pose. If you look in the mirror, my arms are parallel with the bar rather than down here. If it's too hard to hold your half pyramid here, put it out to the sides. So there's your half pyramid, you got a flat back. And then full pyramid, keep your abs drawn and you're lowering, aiming your nose down towards your knee. And just in the spirit of sidedness, check how close your nose comes, kind of make a measurement. If your feet lean down here, you might have like two hand spans. You can use your own body parts to check. One hand span, a fist, two fists. Or you could touch your nose to the knee, which is all good and fine. So that is pyramid posture. And then from pyramid, you lift up and you're going to warrior three. So you're transitioning your weight onto that front foot. Try not to open up like you're doing a half moon posture. You're gonna to stay to go to warrior three. So hip points are forward. Shift your weight very slowly, gently, and staying balanced. Remain balanced through your transition. And I'm slowly, I'm gonna start on a bent knee. I'm gonna lift up that back leg and try to get to where I'm parallel to the floor. And you can have your arms out to the sides or out forward. So here is your warrior three, either there or there. And then from there, see if you can maintain your balance and transition to a posture where the leg is in front, maybe to a standing like eye of the needle posture or something or tree pose, and then make your way back, wobble a bit to mat. The end, easy. Warrior one, half pyramid, pyramid, warrior three, and then transition out of warrior three into another standing posture. That's it, ta-da, easy peasy. Good job, kids. Love and light to you.